What's going on everybody? Welcome back to LSPDFR and uh, another exciting episode of the Wrestling County Roleplay with me, Trooper 93. Today guys, as you can see, we are going to be out here uh, with the Richland County Sheriff's Office in this uh, 2018 Dodge Charger by Ripple and the uh, skin is from my uh, this is actually an old one of my original skins, but it's from the uh, Richland County uh, skin pack. So, of course, you can find uh, all my skins for the Richland County roleplay and uniforms and everything will be linked in the description. And uh, that is for everything Mansfield, Richland, Ontario. Uh, that's all we got so far. So. Alright guys, with that being said, let's go ahead and uh, get on out there and see what we can get into. 923, go ahead and show me uh, in service. Uh, that we uh, a little bit of a hot rod in there today, huh? Catch yeah, you, buddy. The traffic could be eastbound Marlowe 21 Robert Victor Lincoln 363. All right, here's a uh, Jester registration has expired. So, what the hell? Arthur Kane, oh shit, he's expired too. Oh man. He didn't take off on me in this thing. That would have been fun. Hello, sir. It's uh, Deputy Goon with the Richmond County Sheriff's Man. Now, you got your license and registration insurance on you, bud? You got course, any ID on you I can look at? Let's see what he's giving us here. Appreciate it. He gave us all his information. As you can see, uh, okay. His registration is expired. Alright, All right, let's go ahead and check your seatbelt here, buddy. Alright, driver has no seatbelt on. Oh, man. Hey, man, any reason why uh, why you're not wearing your seatbelt today? You don't usually wear it? Okay, well, I mean, uh, fortunately, it's the law, okay? Well, not unfortunately, but now you're fully aware of that? Okay. You just don't want to do it. I got you. Alright, so here we got some other issues, man. First of all, do you know why I pulled you over? I hope we give you some driving tips. Yeah, well, um, first driving tip I'd get you, you know, would like to give you is, is slow down. Okay, you were doing 42 and a 25, sir. I just told you, it was 25 back there on that road where I clocked you. Any reason why you're going so fast? Uh, you just you just like to you just like to drive fast, is that all it is? Okay. Alright man, so uh next of all man, what's first of all is you know your license is expired. Get back in February. Oh, you figured you would save some money. 
All right, well, we'll see how that works out for you. Also, you wear that your uh, registration is expired. Yeah, and all right, all right, you you just uh, you just full of jokes today, aren't you, buddy? All right, man. I tell you what, why don't you just go ahead and uh, where where are you headed to? You're gonna remain silent on that one. All right, man. I tell you what, why don't you just go ahead and hang out here for me, okay? You're live streaming this whole thing right now. All right. That is no problem. Yeah, do you have anything illegal in there we didn't know about? That's for you to know and me not to find out. All right, well, we're going to find out. All right, hang tight. Not to three. Uh, can I get an additional one? Assistance required in Vinewood Hills. Alright, so this guy's not driving out of here today. He's got no license. Ocean one in route. And no restriction, so. No valid license of registration, I should say. Alright. Alright, what's up, fellas? Come on. You're cup! Alright. So this guy, uh. I got him on an expired uh, registration and license, so we're going to take him out, and uh, we'll go from there. If everything's good, uh, yeah, we're going to uh, kill the car, and uh, he'll be on his way. Let's see. Alright. Alright, my man, why don't you go ahead and step out for me, okay? So, hold it! All right, man. So here's what's gonna happen. All right. To, uh, you have no, uh, you you have no valid license, no no valid registration. You have no business out here driving this car, okay? So we're gonna we're gonna be impounding the vehicle, okay? Can I cite you and let you drive it? No, I can't let you drive out of here. It's not even, like I said, you don't have a valid license and there's no valid registration. Obviously, you can't drive it, so. Why would you even ask such a thing? I mean, are you just, are you stupid or what? How about you go fuck off? All right, all right, man. Tell you what, though, we're gonna, we're gonna search the uh, vehicle because we have to tow it, so. If you need to know, uh, is there anything that we need to know about in there? You tell me now. Yeah, yeah, you keep, keep asking, you acting real nervous about that kind of question, so, I don't know, are you, are you have any weapons in there? You really hope not, okay. Alright, my man, hang on. Uh, why don't you just go ahead and, uh, why don't you just go ahead and follow me, okay? Only I have to come over here. Alright man, go ahead and have a seat there for me on the ground if you would please. Alright. So, yeah. Search the vehicle. 20 ounce soda, a motorbike helmet, an open bottle of whiskey, ink pens, and a pawn shop ticket with a large amount of tools. Okay, so. We're not getting any indications uh, from him that he has been drinking or anything. But the, the, that's all about. All right, man, go ahead and stand up for me. You know you have a, a uh, you have an open alcohol container in your on your passenger side. Have you been doing any drinking today? No. Okay. Well, I believe you, but uh, either way, like I said, I don't know why you would you can't have that on you. So, other than that, man, just go ahead and hang tight for me here, and uh, we'll get you taken care of. All right, get you out of here. All right, all right, guys. So we're in. Uh, 
in the system here and uh oh god he is 23 years old so let's see alcohol open container and motor vehicle okay so we got that right off the bat got him speeding he was doing 42 and a 25 holy shit he was doing 17 17 over uh we're gonna give him a little bit of a break on that though so say 10 to 14. Get him for his, uh, let's get him for, uh, fired, uh, registration greater than 30 days and expired license greater than 30 days. I think that will do it for him. Yeah. Oh, I uh, saw so the, uh, He was not wearing his uh, seat belt. Definitely uh, forgot about that. Yeah, we don't allow that. Let's see. We just find out where that is. Equipment safety belt violation. It's quite a handful of. Uh, Tickets for this young man today. Let's see, one, two, three, four, five tickets. All right. I mean, you guys are good to go. I appreciate it. I'm gonna everything cool here. All right, Arthur. So here's the deal, man. You're gonna be receiving five citations today. One's gonna be your uh, seat belt. You got two for your documents, your registration, and your license, and uh, one for your open container, and then one for your speed, okay? Now, your speed, you were doing 17 over the speed limit. I caught you at 42 and 25. I'm going to write you a ticket for 10 to 14. I get a little bit of a break on that, okay? So, here's all that. I just need you to sign those. It's not an admission of guilt. It's just that you will take care of them in the court directions. are on the back. You can take care of them online, in person. Uh, you know, by telephone and way uh, you know that you choose, but figure to do so will turn into a warrant. So you don't want to don't want to do that. So, all right, man, I appreciate that. All right, sir. So you are. Uh, would you like us? Uh, you know, we'll give you. Can you call you uh, call you somebody for you? Oh yeah, yeah, an Uber. Get a chair. All right, man. All right, man. Well, have a good day. Like I said, get that. Uh, hold on. Get that paperwork taken care of. You can get your car back, okay? All right. All right, right there. Go ahead and send me a flatbed. We'll put it on a flatbed. We don't want to mess anything up for him. Flatbed. Assistance required in, uh, yeah, we'll Bywood Hills. All right, right there. Show me in service. Okay, no, I do not want to park. Say, oh, that's just not cool. Yeah, I know. I'm sorry. I just don't want you. Thanks. <laughs> I guess he's just gonna walk. Desert. How far? That's two miles away. Right. Nine right there. 4 We'll take that. So we have a uh, robbery in progress. Of course, we're two about two miles away. Yeah, another unit, right? 
23, I'm on scene. Gonna be at the uh so it's gonna be at the discount store here on 68. Alright. Ah! Shit! Come oh, on, man. Shot fire! Shot fire! Ended badly for us. Alright, guys, so we're getting a uh, report that uh, we have a bicycle, somebody on a bicycle out on the freeway. Some callers are concerned about that. Follow this guy uh, up here in the Toledo. Try to uh, catch up with him now. Let's see what this guy is. Well, he appears to be moving pretty good. Nine twenty three. Be advised, I have uh, that bicycle now. We're going to be uh, southbound Route One coming out of here. All right, my man. Suspect leaving the freeway. Talk to you, Meg. No ground. Enter the road right. for you, pal. Uh, let's see. All right, Idiot! Hi, right, right there. We have one detained. This time. All right. They're under our list, dumbass. Near code four. No further units required. Narcotic intoxication. Alright. Alright, man, come with me. We're gonna step over here, uh. And get over here out of traffic, okay? Why don't you just go ahead and hang out right here for me, bud? Alright. God damn it! I know. I'm sorry. 
That's supposed to be Ohio Highway Patrol. I forgot to put them back. Alright, but we are going to just... Uh, This gentleman's bicycle out of the middle of the road here if we can. Thought he's gonna try to run there for a minute, that would have been interesting. I don't think we've ever chased a bicycle. Alright man. Hey. Um what's your name, man? Not to be advised, we're, I'm out with that, so let's make that Procopio Promenade and Route 1. Can I uh, check one more? Okay. Jason and the Statum Route. Alright, Jason, what, uh, what's going on today, man? What are you doing? Just hanging around? Alright, where did you come from? You came from your friend's house, and where are you headed to? You're on your way home. All right, man. Well, you realize you just rode a bicycle down the middle of the freeway, down Route One. Uh, you can't be. Uh, you can't be doing that, you know. Hey, are you? Uh, have you had uh, used any? Uh, what are those uh, needle marks on your arms, Dave? You donate plasma. Okay. So, uh, have you been using uh, any drugs today or anything? That's just a question we gotta ask, man. Just wondering. Take some prescription pills. Alright, would you mind, uh, would you mind doing a little, uh, sobriety test for us, man? No problem? Alright, man, we appreciate that. Alright. All right, sir. There we go. All right. So, so what you do, okay? I'm gonna have you a one-legged stand. And, uh, actually, we cannot. Okay. Uh, how about this, man? We're just going to give you a uh, little drug swab, okay? Actually, you know what? Damn. All right, man, I'm on, I'm on. I'm gonna release these handcuffs for me. I don't think you're uh, presenting a threat to me or anything right now. So I'm gonna take these off. I just want you to uh, stay and don't do anything stupid, okay? That way we can go ahead and give you that. Uh... Alright, man. Now we should be. Alright, man. So what we're gonna do is have you take. Uh... I'm gonna have you hold one leg off the ground. Put your arms out to your side, you hold one leg off the ground, count 1, 1,000, 2, 1,000, 3, 1,000, go all the way to 10, 1,000 if you can, okay? Oh, you can't do that? Alright, man. How about this? I want you to uh, go ahead and uh, take 10 steps forward, heel to toe. In a straight line, 10 steps back, heel to two. And uh, whenever you're ready, have you go this way. Alright, go ahead. Whenever you're ready. Please don't walk off the bridge. Alright. Alright, man, go ahead and walk back to me. Anyway, he's uh, obviously a little. People's a guy. Alright. Alright, man. So. Go ahead and. Uh, right. 
I wonder. I'm pretty sure you can get a DUI on a bicycle. But let me see. Let's see. Then, if you're seeing the drinking water, you can only lose your drive license for riding a bike. Alright. It is illegal to ride your bike under the influence of drugs, and you would be guilty as you unfit to ride section of sense with the five proper for the bicycle to get to the where you run a footpath or on the road. Yeah, that's what I thought. Okay. Absolute. Alright, man, so at this time. So I'm gonna get you played, turn around, push your hands, find your back, palms together like you're praying. So you'll be in place under arrest for uh, driving under the influence of drugs. Yes, sir. You absolutely can be arrested for riding a bicycle, and not only that, you're uh, bicycling on the freeway, which uh, is also illegal. So, why don't you go ahead and come with me, my man? We're gonna go ahead and uh, we're gonna go ahead and get out of this road now, okay? That's right, my gun's up for us. Alright, man. 923, I got one in custody. Alright, my man. What the shit? Get out. Get out the damn car. Come on, man. Get out. Come on. Alright, man. Go ahead and step out for me. Technically, we uh, should have had to have had it down first. Before putting him in the car, that was my bad. Alright, you got anything on you? It's gonna poke me, or stick me, or harm me, any weapons illegal, anything like that? Nothing. I won't pat you down, okay? So he's got a notepad with names and addresses of trap houses, which is a little suspicious, but not necessarily illegal. A car key fob and a tire pressure gauge, so... Alright, that's it. He ain't got nothing on him. So, we're gonna go ahead and... Uh, Tell you what, man, we're gonna go ahead and run him in, and uh, that's gonna be it for, uh, for for us today. All right, man, go ahead and have a seat for him. Mind right there, show me in route to uh, county jail. It should only take a second anyway. Let's go ahead and just, uh, so we're going to go ahead and get him for misdemeanor, uh, DWI, or felony DWI. What's that, Bell? Oh, okay. So we're going to get him for his, uh, DWI first offense. And then, let's go ahead and get him for that. Oh, wait. That was a citation. Oh, that's what I said. Okay. So now we're going to cite him for, if we have it on here, operating a bicycle. Uh-huh. 
Uh, let's see. Here we go. Unlock your off the bike bicycle on a highway. Sign up for that. And we're gonna take them in, and then uh, I think we're gonna go to court. Uh, that's gonna be it. Hey, thanks for hooking me up. Did you just be uh, right around the corner here? All right, man. We're gonna have uh, somebody come out there and get that for you. We'll be with you. 923, can you have a uh, unit run out there and pick up that bicycle um, sitting on the corner of uh, Procopio and uh, Brown? Alright, we're going to have somebody run out there and pick up your bike for you and I'll have it for you down here at the station, okay? Somebody in this office is making the book. Making more to me. Enough of bitches, man. Too much hassle. I don't give a shit. <laughs> uh, all right, man. Just remember, man, you can't be out here operating. Uh, can't be out here operating intoxicated. Right? You can't drive anything, man. That's that's. I'm assuming because you were high, that's why you were just out running down the highway, anyway. So. Right, I'm going to take these cuffs off you, okay? So, hopefully, uh, you know, get your stuff together, learn your lesson, and uh, get some help. Mierda! Alright. Alright, guys, let's go, boss. uh... I don't give a shit. Let's go back out here and, uh, see what everybody got. All right. Let's go through our court cases. Uh, Looks like we got uh, just two. So Arthur Kane. Okay, so he was open alcohol container uh, in a motor vehicle, unlawful speed, 10 to 14 over, expired registration and expired driver's license, greater than 30 days. She was fined a total of seven hundred and eighty-nine dollars for all that, and then all, and then his uh, safety belt violation. He was fined one hundred one dollars. So, Jason Stratum, uh, we saw DWI first offense, fined two hundred seventy-eight dollars, license suspended for thirty-three months, granted probation. But we're actually gonna wait. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, that was right. Um. So yeah, so he got probation, no prison time, fine two hundred seventy-eight dollars, but his license will be suspended for thirty minutes. And then uh, unlawful to operate bicycle on the highways, fine fifty-six dollars. All right, guys, that's gonna do it for this uh, episode of the Richland County Roleplay with Trooper Nine Two Three. Hope y'all enjoyed it. Please subscribe if you haven't already, and we will see you all next time.